no evil will touch the godly psalms chapter 91 and verse 7 though a thousand fall at your side though 10000 are dying around you these evils will not touch you this is a phenomenal text written by moses a psalm after he completed the tabernacle in the desert it was his personal experience of dwelling in the shelter of god The psalm became the mantra for many preachers during the season of COVID when nothing about the virus was known. Everyone claimed the promises in Psalm 91 and many preached extensively on it. If we carefully look at it, it is not a psalm for crisis, it is a psalm of reminder for every one of us to be in the presence of God all our life and not during troubled times. If we dwell in the presence of God, we are safe because he protects and rescues us from any kind of catastrophe. The question is is God part of our life all our days or we do we desperately look for him in moments of uncertainty as a pastor I've always encountered people being so reckless until they are stuck with some serious issue of life then they are present for all the events in church and eventually disappear when everything becomes all right you can expect to see them for another crisis it doesn't mean that people who love God are free of crisis They do have plenty but they do not panic since they know God had permitted for them to go through for a purpose and they know the evil would never harm them. It would just try them but nothing untoward will happen. Whose shelter are we in? Our own technology driven protection or God's full proof protection? Believe me, if you love being in the presence of God, nothing can bother you. No evil will touch the godly. Amen.